right guys, today I am over at Canton Center Mall here in Canton. The only reason I'm here is because they are taking down the steps to Macy's. I don't know what all they're gonna be doing over here today, but I'm gonna hang out here for a little bit and see what I can see. See if they'll let me go up here and film a little bit closer. All right, guys, yeah, look at this. We've got, uh, this used to be the steps over here coming down. A long time ago, there used to be a railing up here, as you can see, and uh, people came out here and cut it down, apparently, to go sell it. But yeah, they've taken the steps down on both sides. I just talked to the guys back here, and they said, uh, basically, it was to keep people from going up on here. There were skaters going up here and, and skating on the top, and... I mean, where there's a will, there's a way, you know, so people will still get up there, I'm sure of it. But yeah, this used to be the Macy's, the Kaufman's, O'Neill's, you can even still see down here the old uh, Kaufman's uh, label scar up there. I remember shopping in here. This was all glass up here, and every time I come back, there's even more of it busted out, and actually right now it looks like there is not any glass left at all. It is all gone. I filmed a, uh, oh, a little music video here with my son a few years ago for school, and there was still glass up here, and the, and the doors were still up there. It was all shattered but actually he was standing up on here and we edited this thing together where he like stomps and ends up down here. It's pretty cool. <laughs> I'll have to see if I can find it and put it in here. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's what we got right now. They tore down the steps on both sides. Kinda strange to look at all this stuff, you know? Just all this rubble now. And this used to be a, a beautiful place. Huh. All right. So that's how it looks right now. I asked them if they were gonna take down the whole platform and they said no, right now it's just the steps. So, pretty interesting. I was actually hoping to get a little bit of inside info, <laughs> like maybe they were going to start tearing the whole thing down so I could go inside there and film. I've been wanting to get inside there for a long time. I've been into the back end of the mall, um, but once you get to those doors at Macy's, they are locked up tight, so there's no going in there. Look guys, if I switch to the, uh, the wide view, you can see the entire building. That's pretty cool. All right, let's go over to the uh, to the other side here. That's where they're working over there. Show you what's going on over here. Not a whole lot, but here's the other side. You can clearly see the Kaufman's label scar up there. And over here, there's there's still quite a bit of glass over here. But still, every time I come back, there's more of it busted out. Let's go see what the sign says here. Canton Center Mall, no parking at any time, no tractor trailers, cars, vehicles, overnight parking. I don't know if this parking lot out here is considered Canton Centers or Walmart now, but there's always trucks parking out here overnight. Yep, look, this used to all be glass, guys. Busted out now. I'm sure in no time, all of this will be busted out too. There's even big chunks of glass on the ground here. Some more here. I don't know why that surprises me. 
But I'll tell you one thing, guys. Standing right here, you can smell the mold that's inside. I mean, it is just, it's strong standing right out here. I haven't been over here for a little while, but every time I come over here, I just want to start walking around and exploring. It's the old loading docks. There's the rest of them all down that way. They keep this pretty well hidden back here. I mean, like if you're driving on the road out there, you cannot even see that there is the rest of the mall back here. Cool thing about this label scar up here, guys, if you look at it, every single one of those little divots and marks on the concrete is all evidence of an old label scar. O'Neill's, Macy's, well, and obviously Kaufman's. And I was standing here looking at it, trying to see, like from all the little tiny dots up there, it, you know, it looks like right up here between the two ends that there was an apostrophe, so that's probably from when it was Macy's, I would guess. But, I don't know, it's hard to tell, man. I love that, though. Label scars are always such an awesome part of these old buildings.